Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming and on today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to complete every single challenge in the upcoming Forza Thorn event starting on the 8th of December in which you can win the BMW M4 Horizon Edition. So let's get stuck in here. Um, first things first though, I don't know why they're using an Astra VXR uh, for a mainly BMW and drifting orientated Forza Thorn. Uh, the first thing that comes to mind with an Astra VXR is not drifting, it's oversteer. But anyway, um, that's just a little picky thing but yeah. Uh, so the first challenge here called three star performance wants you to get three stars on a drift zone to earn 55,000 XP uh, the next one called sideways living in a VXR apparently uh, wants you to perform 20 drift skills to receive 35,000 credits third one called lapping it wants you to complete five races in a BMW to win the BMW M4 Horizon Edition and the last one called drop the flag wants you to complete a flag rust match in a BMW to win three wheel spins so they're all four challenges so let's get stuck in on the first one here which only wants you to get three Three stars on a drift zone to earn 55,000 XP so this one's actually a very easy one uh, so what I suggest is you pick a car that you're comfortable drifting with so as you can see here I've got my Nissan Silvia S15 Horizon Edition uh, I then filtered my map uh, to show all of the drift zones so you can pick any one of these just make sure you hit that three star point uh, so the one I'm picking here wants you to get 80,000 points to get three stars it is one of the easiest ones because they're quite long bends uh, so providing you're in a car that you're really comfortable drifting in it will be fairly easy for you uh, I have sped the footage up a bit as well so it might look a bit skittish and fucking mental but don't worry it's sped up <laughs> um, but yeah this is probably one of the easiest ones you don't have to do it in the Nissan Silvia it's entirely down to yourself what drift car you pick but as long as you're comfortable using it uh, the next challenge here just wants you to get 20 drift skills to earn 35,000 credits now in the first challenge there you would have probably got about maybe five uh, drift skills if not more uh, so what I'd then recommend is coming over here to the airfield uh, and you know stay in the same car if you want or not you can change car it really doesn't matter but what I recommend is just drifting as much of the airfield as possible uh, by the time you get to halfway you probably would have got your 20 drift skills like I said you already got a few in your first challenge so it's really not hard it's very very quick before the end of the runway you'll have completed the challenge so it's a very easy one uh, third challenge here wants you to get uh, complete five races in a BMW to win the BMW M4 Horizon Edition so obviously you're going to go into your cars and I'm pretty sure every single one of you will have a BMW don't worry now it doesn't matter if it's not the fastest or not uh, you can always use the perks to help you out in a race now in the end I just went for my BMW i8 but you can pick any BMW you want whether it's slow or fast it does does not matter like I said if you only have slow ones or you're not comfortable using them for example because they're rear wheel drive whatever you can use the perks to put you at the front of the pack for the races now what I'm going to do is go over to my usual highway circuit here uh, and you can set up a championship if you want to five races across the board if you really want but that will take a while so what I recommend doing is basically making a new blueprint which is what I'm doing here just for BMWs one lap in every race um, and then just rinse and repeat basically uh, so it is fairly easy I don't know what the fuck's happening with my capture here um, for some reason it's incredibly skittish but you get the gist uh, so all you have to do is complete a race it's as easy as that not very hard at all uh, so somehow lagging into the next fucking challenge I don't know what's going on there um, it wants you to complete a flag rush match in a BMW to win three wheel spins uh, so a very very easy one again there's two ways you can go about this first one is going on to an online adventure um, and selecting a custom adventure then games only but the problem with this is you might have to wait for a flag rush event to pop up because you'll be playing things like king etc so what i recommend doing is going to an online adventure then when you're in one go over here to the airfield and pick a playground game select flag rush and then create your own blueprint or use one that's already there for you um, i created my own one to an open event for everything uh, luckily one person in the whole fucking event joined thank god um, which allowed me to obviously play a game of flag rush so in this all you have to do is get as many flags as possible back to the sort of bases if you will now it doesn't matter if you win or lose this uh, if you do lose you know you might be hurt but hurt a bit or get a bit of your reputation lost but it doesn't matter all you have to do is complete get to this finish screen and receive all of your credits and rewards uh, anyway guys i hope that this helped you out i do apologize for the little skittish bits in my capture there i'll have to get that sorted out um, anyway i hope that you enjoyed like i said Please do subscribe for more videos just like this if this has helped you out. And last of all, massive thank you for everyone's support over the past year. Um, a massive, massive thank you. I do hope that you enjoy and thank you very much.